In this video, we'll be going over the Oris panel. The Oris panel can be accessed via the account page here, found at the bottom of the console. The Oris panel displays the currently active orders in one convenient location. As we can see in this scenario here, we have two active orders. We have the group column, which indicate orders that are linked as either OCO, one cancels other, or OSO, one submits other. And the status column displays the current order status green for active. By clicking on the C, we can cancel the active order. Now in the upper right-hand corner, we have the plus icon. By clicking on it, we can create an order. And from here, we can select the symbol, whether it's a buy or sell, and the other appropriate settings. In this case, we're going to discard. Here we can refresh the orders coming from the broker. And here we can click on the Show Filled Orders icon to show the filled orders. We can edit orders directly from the orders table by selecting the order and then editing the appropriate cell. So for instance, if I wanted to change the expiry here, I can click on the expiry cell and then select the change. I can change the quantity, for example. If I want to change the price. Now after any changes are made, you'll notice there'll be a T here for transmit and D for discard. You would have to click on the T to transmit the changes. And then once the changes are accepted, the transmit no longer shows. Of course, we can also discard a change if we decide that we don't want to keep that change by clicking on the D for discard. Now, you can also see additional options by right-clicking on the order. And from here, you'll notice that you can edit the order ticket. So you can make changes here and then click on Modify. You can also cancel the order, cancel all the orders or cancel all the orders for this specific instrument. You can open up a chart tab. You can go back, open a chart window. Let's close that. You can also open the DOM window. And if you want to edit the instrument, you can click on Edit Instrument as well. At any point in time, you can always double click on the order to show the order ticket. And from here again, we can make changes and we can decide to either cancel, close, or modify. In this case, modify, and the changes have been transmitted. So that's it for the orders panel, and we'll see you in the next video.